prepare to amaze your family and friends as we show you some movie mistakes already found in the new Spider-Man Homecoming film. It is Come kind on. of funny. Ah! We suggest you study this video until you know them backwards and forward. This way you can score some cuteness points for being such a brainiac with your movie date. Before we begin, please make sure you subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up. First, take a look at these. Can you guess what feature film these emojis are showing? Disappearing Van Even in the billion dollar franchises, there are going to be mistakes. In the new Spider-Man Homecoming, there are going to be plenty of mistakes and this is just one of them we have already spotted. In this scene, Spidey sneaks up on some criminals robbing ATM machines. The robbers are armed with shotguns ready to kill anything in their way and sporting some sexy Avengers mask. One wears an Iron Man mask, another has on a Green Hulk mask, one has on a Thor mask and the fourth is wearing a Captain America mask. In the background, a van can be seen through the window when the robbers first notice Spidey and we see all four of them. They cut back to a close-up on Spidey saying something annoying clever to the robbers. This upsets them and they attack him. When a fight breaks out between all of them, the van in the back is missing. The fight continues and eventually the van magically reappears. Okay, so most likely some soccer dad had to leave work early to get home and tuck in the kids. We think everyone watching this movie should give this moment a pass. What do you think? Where did they go? Time to look past another mistake and find some humor. A ferry boat floats in the middle of the ocean and all its passengers are enjoying a great time until a massive explosion rips through the hull and sends the crew and guests on board into a panic. The people run for their lives and take shelter any way they can. The ferry boat begins to split in half and is on its way to boat heaven. But wait, who is that? It's Spidey Man! Spidey webs through the boat and sprays his web slinger all over the place. He holds the boat together with his sticky goodness and superhero strength. But in the sky, rockets appear and head directly for the boat. Okay, pause a moment. Where did all the people just go? This boat was filled to the brim just a second ago. Check the water surrounding the boat? Nope. Okay, fine. They were all really fast and made it to land or a speedboat. Let's keep watching. There's Iron Man helping keep the boat together. Hold up. All the people just reappeared and all the cars are gone from the center of the boat when just seconds ago they were clearly there. We are going to assume the cars just feel and the people showed up to get Iron Man's autograph. Sounds plausible, right? <sighs> Vanishing Bikes Let's take a moment to back up to the beginning of this scene since we are talking about this ferry boat. Maybe this will help to explain what the freak just happened. Spidey Man lands on the boat and prepares to battle some hooligans. Take notice of the motorcycles parked on the left there. For now, remember them. Back to the hooligans. Afraid of Spidey, they point their guns at him and without hesitation, he slings two of them each in their chest and does a really cool flip to disable them. Spidey is then attacked from behind, but don't worry, he slings him across the boat. But wait, look there. The motorcycles, where are they? Were they scared off by the fight? Not exactly. If you take a look at the ground on the left, do you notice the yellow stripes? If you look at the image with the bikes, you'll see the stripes are on screen right. We are unsure why the filmmakers decided to mirror the image. What we do know is this is definitely disorienting. I need that money. I missed the part where that's my problem. Motion Pictures Moolah. See if you can notice the mistake in this scene before we tell you. Let's travel back to the bank scene. The robbers have loads of money they are stealing and filling a bag with. Take a look at this image of the money in a bag and tell us what you think is wrong. Did you see it? If you didn't, don't worry. This one is tough. It's right there on the back of the 20. It reads motion pictures. If you still don't get it, here is a picture of the back of a real $20 bill. It reads the United States of America. Yep, that's right. The money the robbers are stealing is fake money. Okay, so this one isn't exactly a mistake. Yes, it's true that it reads motion pictures instead of the United States of America, but for very good reason. 
First off, would you want to keep that much cash on a film set with who knows how many people around? No way! Second off, it's illegal to make your own money. If the prop money is actually stolen and someone tries to use it, the FBI might come after the manufacturer of the prop money or even you. Just look at what happened to the filmmakers when they lost $100 million in prop money. Complete. So for this next Spidey mistake, we need to span across universes and franchises. This one will really impress and show people you are boss at spotting even the smallest mistake. Let's take a look at an establishing shot from a scene in Doctor Strange. This is an aerial shot of New York City. Off in the distance is the Avengers building. Pay close attention to the direction the building is facing. To the left of it is the Chrysler building. In this clip, the Avengers building is facing towards the Chrysler building. Now the next clip is an establishing shot from Spider-Man Homecoming. This also is an landscape aerial shot of New York City. Take a look at the Avengers building. Notice the direction it is facing. Here is the Chrysler building. Notice anything? The Avengers building is facing away from the Chrysler building. What in all that is holy happened? Is this cluing us in on something more tragic? Did the Avengers building blow up and have to be rebuilt? But why in the opposite direction? Maybe they were having solar panels installed and wanted to catch more of the sun's rays. For now, it is safe to assume this was simply a mistake and not a foreshadowing of something worse to come. To aim or not to aim. If you are a hardcore movie watcher, then you most likely watch the same film, time and time again. After a while, you start to pick up on mistakes. It just happens. You know the story so your mind wanders elsewhere and you see more than you saw the first time. Discovering them never gets old. Sometimes it actually helps if you are watching a film with a terrible storyline and you need something to keep yourself engaged, otherwise your date might get upset with themselves they picked a bad movie. Other times, discovering a mistake can be extremely disorienting and take you right out of the moment. Like in this next clip. The audience is pulled in with the danger they might see Spidey sniped off the top of the Empire State Building. A police chopper is behind him and an officer is aiming their rifle. You take a breath, waiting for what is to come, and then it cuts to a closer shot of the officer. But then you see the officer is no longer pointing the rifle and is only starting to take aim. The tension then fades away. But don't worry, the tension will quickly build back and you'll forget all about this movie mistake. Take out the trash. There is nothing better than plopping on the couch and watching a movie after a hard day at work, rough day at school, or an insane day of bathing suit shopping when nothing fits right. But then you get yelled at because you forgot to take the trash out like you said you would when you got home. A huge fight then erupts and lasts for what feels like five days. If only you remembered the trash. In this next clip, we can only imagine someone on the film set had a flashback and just had to take out the trash. Spidey runs across a busy intersection and almost gets hit by a taxi. He dashes into an alleyway to change into his Spidey suit. And there in the background is a trash can full of garbage. Watch that trash can. Spidey changes into his outfit and just as he leaps into the air, we see it. There in the background, the garbage is gone. What could have been so urgent to take the trash out to ruin the continuity of the shot? Was it really someone having a flashback? Worried of being yelled at? Did the garbage man come between takes? Or maybe the flash zipped in to give a helping hand? Any which way, we have a feeling this mistake will never be solved. Hate those things. <sighs> Dude chills with Spidey. Who hasn't dreamt of hanging out with a superhero? That would be an epic end all to have all bragging rights over everyone you know. Imagine standing with someone you know and they tell you about the promotion they just received or the details of their wedding night. But then you're like, BAM! I had a burger with Captain America and strolled along the beach with the Hulk. You tell all about how you both like the same movies. You learn one another's favorite colors. You find out if they take their costume off when they go number two. What? 
Don't act like you haven't thought of that. That's not a weird question. Well, in a pivotal moment in the homecoming film, a boat is splitting into two down the middle. It's about to sink into the ocean until Spidey struggles to hold it together. There's explosions, smoke, and everyone screaming and dashing for their lives, except for this dude. This dude decided to chill, breathe in the fresh air, and taking the time to get to know the true Spidey beneath the mask. All we can say about this is we are not upset. This is one of the greatest mistakes we have ever seen. <laughs> Captain America teaches Jim. It's time for a very brief history lesson about the Avengers Civil War. If you have not seen it, you have been pre-warned this is a pretty epic spoiler. Okay, you had your chance. Now face the consequences. At the end of Civil War, Captain America became a wanted superhero fugitive internationally. This would have dire consequences throughout the world for his reputation. Yes, everyone is innocent until proven guilty, but honestly, how many people actually believe a person is innocent? Let's fast forward a year later after the captain was deemed a criminal. In Spider-Man Homecoming, Captain America is seen on a television set promoting fitness to kids. Wait a second, it has been a year and this guy is one of the most wanted people in the world. Maybe the two worlds are completely separate and have nothing to do with one another. Which would mean in Spidey's universe, the Civil War never really happened. But that theory just doesn't make sense because we see Spidey watching a scene from Civil War on his laptop. So this is either a major, major mistake or something larger is at play here. We are still on the fence for this one and need your help. Tell us what you think. That thing does not obey the laws of physics at all. Movie trailer tells all. So when someone is trying to decide on a movie to watch, almost always the first question to pop in their head when they read a title is, I wonder what this is about. After all, maybe curiosity kicks in and you get the hankering to know more. Maybe then you'll read the tagline. A woman and her dog go on a cross-country road trip. Okay, that sounds cute and lovable. Let's go watch that. But then your friend you call to go with you wants to know more. So maybe you watch a trailer to get a better idea. But after seeing the trailer, you now know the entire film and decide on something a bit more elusive. This definitely is not a great formula for a film. There is a fine line between too much and too little. You know, the sweet spot. The Spider-Man Homecoming is a fun action-packed film, but the trailer is a huge no-no. It gives far too much away, especially about Iron Man's character. The biggest mistake in our mind was the ferry boat, which is arguably one of the coolest scenes. Watching the trailer, you already know what's going to happen. We hope in the future trailers they leave more of a mystery. Which mistakes were your favorite? Which ones were unforgivable? Let us know in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe and share this video. Oh yeah, here is the answer to the emoji question. Did you get it right? What did you think it was? Let us know. Thank you for watching.